Hey, what's up traders? Welcome to the next way trading. My name is Lester. In this video, I'm going to share with you how to use this strategy, the best binary option strategy on Sunday. Today is Sunday. The market is OTC and the market in these days is risky, but you can use it to practice using this strategy and practice the weekends. Let's rock with this video. Okay, guys, we are going to see uh, the two minutes strategy and how to trade with this two minutes strategy. Um, you can use this strategy the, the weekends to practice. I, I made this type of videos because I read your comments. I read your uh, suggestions. I see a lot of this uh, type of content on the moment that I send a few signals and, and the moment that I receive a few comments in my videos. It is what is the best moment to enter, how to configure the indicators, list your OTC is writable or not. Please trade in the OTC market and blah, 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 blah. Well, we are going to use it today a practice account and to using on to trade with this strategy. And let's go to find a good moment to enter. I'm going to explain how uh, step by step everything about this strategy, okay? So let's go to put in one thousand dollars. Practice money. So it's okay. This uh, this looks good. Well, what is the rules and how you need to configure the indicators? Well, I'm gonna explain the rules first. We are gonna use a three moving average. I exist another video. I'm gonna make another video when the moving average uh, color white fifty, but this is not the case. Okay. We are going to use a three moving average. We are going to use a moving average red period 26, um, moving average color blue period 6, moving average uh, simple 3R simple moving average, um, moving average color yellow uh, period 14. We are going to use in MACD for default. And the rules is going to be the moment they cross in the MACD, for example, this one was a put crossing here the MACD. And we enter, uh, I think crossing the MACD here. We enter here, was eating the money for enter for two minutes. We trade for two minutes and candles in two minutes, like that. And we enter for this candle, was eating the money. And this one, another a good advice I'm gonna give you just wait this, this jump always made this these candles because always happen that and you're gonna stay in the money. And this one definitely in the money. So maybe here crossing the MACD, you only enter, only enter if crossing the MACD and we are going to wait. See, half a volatile market today, but we are going to wait. Let's go to find, trying to find another good currency, another opportunity and to show you how I trade with this strategy. Uh, using, uh, follow this advice, you're going to get the better results in your trades, trust me. Uh, Touch it, but see the MACD. So I prefer to stay away. It's the, let's go to find another. This is, looks good, but the same. We are gonna wait for crossing the MACD, and this, that is gonna be our opportunity to uh, trade with this strategy. Tips to get the better results with this strategy in two minutes. Well, trade, follow the trend. You are gonna get the better results if you trade, follow the trend. Avoid the trivial news. Okay, first go. Three, uh, trade, follow the trend, avoid the trivial news. And third, wait the indicators always met, okay? All the time met. So wait all the time for that. You're going to get the better results if you follow these three simple tips, three simple advice. So we are going to wait for this and we are going to trade, okay? Let's see, let's see. Crossing. Well, we are waiting for this, but never crossing the MACD and the moving average. And what happened with this? See it? Don't cross it. The MACD it was a red. This was out of the money. I don't know if you enter waiting a little bit. You enter here was in the money, but don't respect our indicators. So we are waiting. Just we need to have patience for this strategy to get the better results, to get um, a good opportunity to enter. So. It's the same case here, never cross on the MACD, so we don't enter. Um, follow the trend, this is a good one, but 
if it crosses the MACD, I don't enter. Uh, this is look it looks the same. And this is uh or more stable market actually. Let's go to wait, okay guys? Wait for a good opportunity. And only have this these pairs opened today. We are seeing the the the, the MACD. How to trade? Well, we're gonna enter all the time for two minutes, so we are only wait for uh, just a little bit. Come on, I record this trade session live. Uh, today is Sunday. Today is Sunday in the morning. Um, see the MACD. Waiting for the MACD. Well, I prefer my recommendation is if you cross first the MACD. And after the moving average, it's a better scene, okay? There is a better scene in two minutes. So, MACD, MACD, MACD. Let's go to refresh, maybe sometimes. I told you, I told you. We're gonna enter for two minutes. I've been waiting, 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 Another good opportunity here. This looks good. But I need to wait. Can we cross it? Hmm. Here never cross it. have this one in the money and we have another good opportunity with this one we are gonna enter for two minutes and see what happened okay crossing the MACD and waiting for uh, how ending this trade it's going to find another one uh, oh well never crossing the MACD uh, this one this one here no Mm, no, this I entered with this one was in the money, so I think it only signal what signal we have right now is this one and waiting how it ends. Let's say why you enter before to touch the moving average. Well, in two minutes, this is gonna be for two minutes. I noticed always crossing uh, before the MACD all the time, all the time crossing before, and just like I say, I wait for that little jump or drop depends uh, the direction of the uh, trade we are going to take it and that signal is a good a moment to enter in the moment of crossing the MACD so crossing with this one I can enter in this candle but I prefer just wait and see what happens so I, we are going to see with this one and how endings have a, uh, a, I don't know a, a stronger resistance here for, that's for a reason start with this one and, and see that here too because have a stronger resistance here and happen with this see boom have the, that jump so uh we are gonna see how and then and this is how i trade with this two minutes strategy i like it i like it wait a little bit um to get a better sr to trade oh come on draw oh i think it can be in the money okay i'm gonna enter again but oh um, don't have that little jump just wait for that jump come on come on come on come on no don't have so uh, don't come in that uh, reverse. Um, let's go to see it. No, I think it lost a good opportunity here. But well, this is how I trade with this two minutes strategy. I like to trade with this strategy, but uh, trying to follow the trend. 
respecting the your indicators. I know, Lester, you enter before the crossing the, 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 the moving average. Yes, I I trade like that, but if the strategy is enter the moment the touch of the moving average, for example, in this candle, you enter. But I enter in the moment the crossing the MACD and I like it trade with that. This one was draw, but uh, I don't know. With this one, I lost my opportunity to get a get good profits. Um, was a lovely to see. Uh, but this is how I trade with this strategy. This is what it's, it's right about. Just have the patience. Using it in two minutes, you're going to get a better or more opportunities in, in less time or more time. Because all it's only in two minutes. So uh, the trends change a lot of the directions on, in a few hours. So you need to follow this strategy step by step just like i told you here and this is how i trade with this two minute strategy i like it straight when the moment they cross in the magd this is a good one i lost my opportunity because i think maybe have a little jump and i have a better start to trade and that is not was the case but i think we have a good strategy here with two minutes strategy for this strategy you need to stay focused and waiting focus and waiting your computer because have that move so fast and we lose a good opportunity to enter you see uh, right now i lose two opportunities with these two candles um but i think this strategy is so writable and you can start to use it and to make money online with binary options i recommend you if you trade with binary options and like this strategy using otc market just like i'm doing today to practice practice a lot with this strategy you're gonna get the better results in your trades so i hope this video like it don't forget to subscribe to my channel activate the notification bell smash this video and see you in the next video